Thank you for watching Not My Bag. If you're watching this, make sure to like and subscribe. If you're listening, give a five-star review on Apple Podcasts and Spotify. Hello and welcome back to another episode of Not My Bag. I'm Joe. You're, you're least mum's drinking wine. Uh, uh, <laughs> anyone knows who I am, so there's no point in introducing myself. <laughs> Love that intro, mum. And this week we have a very, very special guest. It is the one and only Brie Runway. Welcome, welcome. Do we have like a clapping? Yeah. Yeah. Well, get the whole studio going. It is so amazing to have you here. How are you? I'm so happy to be here. I feel very much at home with my gang. <laughs> <laughs> I love the way we've all got our shades yeah, on. Yeah. yeah, it's just that kind of like, yeah. Mm. Repping the merch the as well. Okay, it's the bags vibe. It's exactly. the bag. Welcome to the bags vibe. Exactly. <laughs> so I was going to start off because I don't know whether you remember this. You probably don't. Um, I came to your show at the, the you know, when you headlined the Colors Hoxton show. Uh, it was like a year was. ago. How can I forget? Oh my god. Oh no. Are you brave? <laughs> oh my god. Are you brave? I think I cried, guys. You. I think you I cried. You did cry. I did cry. And you then, did cry. do you want to know something really funny? I went home and uh, with my boyfriend at the time, <laughs> and he said that I laid in bed and just cried for half an hour. Oh. I, well, look. To be honest with you, so the whole of lockdown, I listened to your music, and you're my yes, second. You're my second uh, biggest artist on Spotify this year. Yes. It's only cause the Renaissance album with B, which yes. I'm sure you can uh, appreciate. But uh, obviously, with your new era and coming, I'm yeah. sure you're going to be back up there yes. but I'm pretty much obsessed so I'm so happy to have you here I'm so happy to be here I can't well. believe that that's how you remember it <laughs> <laughs> it was so that, funny that how we would be there. my mum was really emotional my mum was like make sure you get a picture with him get a picture with <laughs> do you know what it was it was because I thought after seeing you like come off stage I thought you were like someone I thought it was someone dressed up as you like what did, <laughs> so I didn't expect to like walk through the door so then when you're in front of me I was like are you Brie. Yeah. Like, you know what I mean? I was shocked. And then when you were like, that. yeah, I was like, oh. <laughs> you are very beautiful. And he said to me, mum, she's stunning. And then he was in, she's even more You are stunning. just oh. gorgeous. You are just so unreal. I'm like, Joe, he's fine. She's so stunning. Well, I'm glad we got that out of the way. <laughs> out the gate. <laughs> we went there first. So I'm really happy you remember. I, I don't no, know I do. good first impressions. So. No, you were cute. You like you were the one I wanted to actually take photos with, and then everyone just became super entitled after you. I was like, "This is me and Joe's moment. <laughs> Go away!" Oh, I love that. I love that. Well, I was going to bring uh, bring that into the first segment about live shows yeah. because I know that you're so into your live shows, and mm -hmm. as a performer, I wanted to just find out about that whole um, coming out of COVID mm -hmm. and then you know yeah. kind of doing that show for the first time. Like, how was that? For you. Do you know what? I was so... COVID really like set me back maybe like 10 years. Mm. Really? It made me feel like I don't know how to do anything. Mm. But I did. It was I, a little bit. I lost mm. my way yeah. more. Because like, yeah, yeah, yeah. with me, like from the start of my career, I designed my own artwork, did my own, edited my own music videos. So I'm very like hands-on. I'll do it till I'm very happy. I'm like, yay! When the lockdown kicked in, I didn't know how to... For like... Three days. I, I, I got my mojo back. <laughs> I got my mojo back. I don't stay, I don't stay down for too long. <laughs> for like three days, for like three days. I kind of didn't know. I was like, so what, what do I do? Yeah. What do I do? So I started with little things like doing an Instagram live concert. That was like, okay, cool. Again. Okay. I was very obsessed with how the sound sounded. And I was like, darling, it's literally an Instagram live concert. Please calm down. <laughs> So there's that. And then I did, I shot a music video at home. So that's another thing. Oh, wow. I did. I shot one in my living room with what a green video was screen. That? So it was Damn Daniel. So it was was it? Video. Yeah, Damn Daniel. Joking. Damn Daniel was shot in my house. I just kind of had to oh take God. myself back to what I remember. Because yeah. I'm yeah. queen, do it yourself. Mm. Like, and have been. So I kind of had to step back into that. And then going back into live, this is the bit where I was like, I don't know if I can sing in front of people. Oh. Uh, will I be okay? Yeah. That was my main thing. Will I be okay? Will I be too shy? And then another thing, I don't actually know if I can sing and dance at the same time, but I'm like, of course you can. <laughs> but I think because of the lockdown, my brain was just like, no, you can't. Mm. You can't. You have mm. to stay inside and do this. No, you can't. You can't do it. You can't do it. Mm. So that first night, if anyone unlocked my corset, shit would have dropped on the floor. <laughs> <laughs> you would have just went on the floor because yeah. I was shitting bricks. 
but you, you, ki- come across you like killed that. it though. The thing though. with me is I have a good face. Do you go into like show mode? Like I do. Just completely like, what's the tunnel vision? That's the word so I'm So it's, it's always like shit bricks for like 30, uh, 30 minutes before. Mm. Shit bricks for like 30 minutes before, but then understand what the people mean mm. yeah. and what they came for and what you mean to them. Mm. So it's like, as soon as I pass that line, once they've like moved the torch and it's like, okay, go forward. It's not about me anymore. Fine. Yeah, you yeah. know what I mean? It's not about, and I feel more comfortable because I feel like I'm doing it for people that I mean I something it. to them. Yeah, they yeah. want it. And they I mean something it. to yeah. them and seeing them happy makes me happy. Mm. So it's just like, it's not worth, like, what are you going to do? Hide behind the drummer. Mm, yeah, you know what I, I mean? I know like, what, what are you going to do? What? On the kitchen sink. Yeah. Like, no, 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 no. Well, no. I was going to say like your fans, I, I mean, just experiencing it, like as, it's such a good vibe. What it, is it like in the crowd? It's, do you know what? Some gigs that I've been to, there's sometimes a bit of like animosity or do you know, some, Ooh. some people are just like very want to get to the front or there's a bit of like aggression between, oh, you know yeah, what I mean? Yeah. I think, but it's just such a good vibe. Like oh, the whole good. gig was so good. I mean, that's why I was on like cloud nine afterwards good. and then it's breakdown. Afterwards. But you need to come. <laughs> Imagine me, you you need get to, up on stage. You need, you need to get your, your ass at a Brie show. <laughs> you do. I haven't got Next enough. She's got a lovely bum. I've got the sweetest bum on the planet. You've got the most oh. beautiful bum I've ever seen. Oh, mum. No, we'll get, we'll get you. Next time, we'll get you. We'll yeah. get you there. And You'll you love it. Leave You'll my love mom. it. Oh. You can stand next to my mum. Because oh my, my mum's yeah. like, she's always at the top bit, out of the way, because she can't do the crowd. Mm. Oh, I would. The crowd is a oh, lot. Lord, when I you start doing the crowd. When you did ATM, the crowd, I was like, oh, yeah. yeah. Someone get me some gas and air because it was <laughs> right. a lot. Wow, really? <laughs> but it's, good. it's such good vibes, honestly. The best, the best. Okay. And so just go, dialing it back to what you said about the live show. Mm-hmm. So after COVID, and then I know you're very meticulous yeah. over your shows and mm-hmm. the rehearsals and also like costume designs. You say you do everything yourself. Do you do the costume yeah, yourself as well? Everything starts on my iPad. Love that. Yeah, the drawings aren't so great. <laughs> Not so proud of I it. I think I've seen them on your story before. Obviously, I have. <laughs> well, I'm it's acting like I have. It's quite bad. It's quite bad. Everything starts on my iPad, the Apple Pen. This is not an endorsement. If you'd like to give me one for free, I'd love <laughs> one. Thank you. If you would like to give me a yearly one, thank you. I would love that. And I always get mine engraved Lady Runway at the back. So please, just letting you know. Apple, <laughs> Apple you've heard. You've heard it here. <laughs> so um, everything starts on my iPad. And then I luckily have like, a design team around me that I've worked with for years that just get what I like. Yeah. You know what I mean? So this it's not like, what the hell is this? Mm. Like they get it, which is good. I have fun. No, I love that. I love that. And speaking of you being quite meticulous, I know that I've, well, I saw this online that you taught yourself how to mix and master records as well. I is did. that right? Not that it's great, but it was great for the time. I mean, it's still like a massive skill. No, it is. And like, I do have to pat myself on the back. It is. It sounds like you're like a one woman <laughs> show machine. Do you know what I mean? It's a like, bit much. No, but I love it. I mean, it's got you to where you are and you're absolutely no, definitely. flying. I did ask him, so I said, did she be boxy? But mum, shut up. Do you know what? No, <laughs> like, let me tell you this. We're in the car. We're in the car. I'm listing like what you've done, right? Hey, oh. I'm talking through these achievements. Oh, I'm oh, like, God. and then I'm over there, mum goes, can she beatbox? <laughs> Why are you naming the one thing that this? I mean, do you know oh, what I mean? She's so super talented. I thought she must be. No, I know how to beatbox, of course. Do you? Yeah. I'm not doing it now. That's <laughs> embarrassing. <laughs> so there's so there's nothing that Brie can't do at no, this point. Obviously no, 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 no. I'm no. obsessed. I'm obsessed. And um, in terms of magazine covers, my favourite recently, the Rolling Stones cover. Oh really? Breakthrough Artist You've of the Year. Amazing. I know. It's it's such 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 a blessing. I was actually looking at it yesterday because my my coffee table is. Full Oh now. <laughs> See your pictures. No, the covers. Oh my god. I it's love full them. now. And I was like, wow. Can we do Rolling that for me? But Rolling Stones is like Could you do that for me? Huge. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, like, it's really big. It Break for artists of the year. Like, yeah. yeah, like whenever you've got Rolling Stones cover, it's like, okay, like Yeah, I know. It's like mental. Oh my god, I said you how, how how was that shoot? Like how was that moment when you got asked to do it? I'm thinking. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. Um, Rolling Stone was after, yeah, it was a half, I did like a half, half Burberry. I did the carpet for Burberry. I did like a TikTok takeover. I felt like you for a second. <laughs> I on. saw that. I come saw on, that. You had the blue on. hair. Yeah. Come on. And then <laughs> the ha- the other half of the day was for Rolling Stone. And it was a really fun shoot, to be fair. It was a really fun shoot. And 
I just don't think I've realized how much of a big deal it was until it mm. came out. Because you know, like when you're just on the wheel and you're- A hundred percent. It's like my yeah, year. It's, it's just crazy. But when I, I think when, when I got the physical, that's when it really sank in that. Yeah. Wow. Oh God. This See, is really one for the books, back. yeah. Have a pat on the back. M- Mum's just come today, just sit here and be like, just you're to killing pat it, me on the back. <laughs> yeah, it's one for the books, definitely. No, oh, yeah. Thank you to today's sponsor, Bunny Hop. Bunny Hops is a family-friendly party game that really brings those laugh-out-loud moments. And if you have a big, loud family, just like George and I, then this is the perfect game for you. I can't wait to be playing this uh, over Christmas, New Year. Bring it on. I know. With a glass of mulled wine in hand. Happy days. Mum screaming her <laughs> lungs out. Yeah. It's going to be the one. Guess as many words as you can in one minute by... Miming. Dancing. Singing. And finishing the lyrics. It's an endless game with nine themes, including... Britannia. Celebrities. Sports. Brands. Music and more. There are 450 cards and over 900 words to choose from. <laughs> we'll be here all night. Oh, we're going to be going for days. Between Christmas and New Year's, we're not stopping. Bunny we're hop- bunny hopping <laughs> every day till 2023. <laughs> bunny Hops is designed for four to 16 players. So everyone can get involved. Family, friends, whatever it is, everyone can get involved. The Bunny Hop game is available now on Amazon. Link is below, guys. Check it out. Give it a buy. You won't regret it. No, I get that 100%. But I know what you mean. Like when you're constantly busy and doing things, I think it's really important to kind of have moments of like gratitude to be like, I can't believe this happening. Because I've had that, mum, you you know this from George and I the last like month or so, you kind of sit there and you're like, this is insane. Do you know what I mean? And like, yeah, and it is crazy. You have to sit down. You have to sit down. Yeah. Otherwise, not that you forget, but you don't fully embrace how far you've come. Yeah. I agree. And it's Especially important when you're to, so busy all the time, you exactly, don't realise what you're doing. Until exactly. After. And I think in years exactly. to come, you think to yourself, oh, I, I wish back you then will, I would I was a bit more present back. in yeah. it, right? It's, yeah. It's, yeah. Yeah. That's the exact thing that I was trying to get to, like being present in that moment. Yep. I have to sometimes shake off everything, as I'm sure you do too, like right before yep. it and be like, no, like you deserve this. You've yep. got to do it. Do you know what I mean? No, like get, even no, do you like. Get nervous, Marie? Oh. Because he gets really nervous. I say to him, no, just deep breath. if you'd be mm. fine. Oh. <laughs> I'm I terrible. wouldn't want to bottle up how I feel when I'm super nervous about something. You'd probably have a heart attack. I really like, like the electricity. Yeah. I'm yeah. like, oh my God. yeah, oh my God. I can't breathe. Cause you see all of this like Brie Runway shit that I do. This is not how I grew up. Yeah. yeah I grew up very sheltered. Yeah, normal I grew life. up very believing I wasn't anything. I grew up believing that not that I wasn't going to amount to something. I knew I was. <laughs> Good girl. Yes. Yes. <laughs> we'll drink, we'll drink yes. to that. Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll drink, drink to, to that. that. I knew. I did know. <laughs> <laughs> but I understand yeah. that. Do you know what I mean? And can like, you do that as well? You need to be present. Yeah. You need to be present. You doubt yourself is, sometimes. You mustn't. Yeah. Don't. Don't. I, I get the same though. I get really nervous. Mm-hmm. But I think nerves are a good thing because it means you care. Do you know? Yeah. Like, I yeah, think yeah. it's a good, it's a natural thing, but you can't let it like overtake you. And yeah. being present is so important. I mean, I was saying today, not to like make this cringy, but I was like, I can't believe that like a year ago I was at your show and then I worked so hard during lockdown and so hard yeah. in the last year. And like now you're here. Yeah, Do you know what I mean? Yeah, had a moment and it's mind. like, yeah, I had a moment oh. where I was like, because it's so, I just said like, it's so it, insane. Yeah, just, can I just interject here? The fact that I'm here as well. Right? <laughs> <laughs> this I've I'm never heard anything here. more my mum in my yeah. entire life. It's you've worked insane, equally. It's not about you. You've worked equally as hard. Yeah, it's not about you, mum. You, you, you made us. Yeah, you made us. Exactly yeah. Look what I created. Yeah, Man, we love you. That's a great mum right there. We love you for it. <laughs> so yeah. powerful I mean, womb. <laughs> very powerful. Well, which is on its way out now. To be honest. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh my God. Well, <laughs> from family over to friends, I thought we could have a chat about your friendships in the industry. Cause yeah. I know I see it on Insta and TikTok all the time. You've got some great friends out there in mm. the music biz. Um, I mean, starting off with Summer Walker, cause I saw the wireless, uh, the wireless thing made me die. Cause didn't you eat before you went on stage? Yeah. It, oh, this was this, that not good? It just made me laugh. The, the <laughs> yeah. Why was it not good? It was the thing I ate. Oh, what did you eat? Because I'm African. Right. And you know, African food is very heavy. Right. And the choice of meal. What did you have then? A thing called banku. What's that? It's like a ball of, um, I don't know what it's made of. And this is probably embarrassing, <laughs> but it's a white ball. Okay. I think it's made out of corn 
with fish and pepper. Right. And the yeah. reason why... No, it's amazing. I should have brought oh, you some. Nice. I bet it's lovely. The reason why I ate it, because when I am about to perform, if I don't eat enough, my head starts hurting yeah, out of nerves. Oh, yeah, yeah. You know what you I mean? Need, need so that, I thought, you, yeah. let me fuel myself up. Big mistake. <laughs> Not that I shat myself or anything. He would. <laughs> If he had something before he went on stage, he would be running off that nah, stage guys, with I a nappy. Would. I would. You I would. would. You'd be no, terrible. I was yeah. literally like, ooh. Oh, that's not and good. And I had a bikini on, but thank God anyway, the abs were present. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I, you killed it anyway. No, it was a really fun, uh, unbelievable experience. I never, I've never done wireless before. And you know where I'm at, it'll probably be like not main stage, it'll be like something else. But for me to do it my first time and it mm. to be main stage, I was like, oh. Wow. My God. Yeah. It was different. So many people look like popcorn. Because <laughs> this is so, that, like, it's so big. many people yeah, yeah. It literally look like yeah. popcorn. It was just like. Yeah, yeah. God, I'd be, was really, like, I'd be so nervous. I <laughs> was like, oh, I would my be. God. No, it was a lot. Yeah. It was a lot. And I didn't have my usual everything in terms of like in ears, this, right, that. Okay. Oh, so oh. I was rolling solo. Why didn't you have an ear? Did you have an ear pacing? No. Why not? I forgot what it was. There was like. They didn't get something right or something oh, like fine. that. So I, had to, I, I went out and made it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, and you then killed I learned anyway. something. Don't go too far without in ears because oh, the hear. audio yeah. really separates. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, it gets fine. really separate. So oh, I was like, oh, stop getting excited. I know you're Brie Runway, but back up the runway. <laughs> yeah, 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 <laughs> stop yeah. walking down the runway. You're getting excited. Go back. <laughs> yeah. No, yeah, I'm you got to stay close. You so stay did close. Summer ask you, um, like, how did that come about with Summer? Yeah. So I, it was really funny. Like, this is one of those full circle moments as well. Like, I was literally on it, on my camera roll looking at the March shows in Brixton and I was like oh I was on the way to like a back appointment because I realized that after the tour I wasn't doing too good with stretching right and my backside hurt you're like I'm carrying the industry I need to I need to go sort <laughs> I'm this out. Literally <laughs> carrying the industry <laughs> so I was on the way to a back appointment I was like scrolling through my phone I was like oh I wish I could do this again and I went on Instagram someone was like hey are you in London and I thought Oh yeah, she's coming to London. She probably wants to see me. Great, I'll I'll make time and see her definitely. So I'm like, yeah, yeah, get on with my business. She's like, do you want to do three songs tonight and tomorrow? I'm like, wait, no, what? Why? What? I said tonight where? She's at Birmingham. And I was like, oh bless her. She probably thought Birmingham was London. I said like, no, I can't go. I can't come to. I can't come to Birmingham. But I'll come to London. Yeah. She was like, yeah, ATM and hot hot. I was like. Not you knowing the set list, darling. <laughs> I'll be there. I no be way. There. That is so That's cool. Amazing. It was crazy. Yeah. It was so crazy. I love that she just hit you up like that. Birmingham? <laughs> yeah, Birmingham. I was like, oh. Birmingham's quite away from That's not a suburb. Yeah, it's a bit far. <laughs> yeah, I was like, oh God, how am I going to prep for that? Okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Rehearsing in the car. My glamour book for the weekend. So I did everything myself. Did you? Yeah, I did hair and everything myself. Yeah, You're a powerhouse. The amount you do on your own, honestly. It's, uh, everyone needs like a squad, but you can just do it on your, on your own if you have to. That's mad. No, if I have to, I'll do it. Yeah, do it. I rate I'll that so it. much. Thank you to today's sponsor, Box Towels. Box Towels is one of the leading single serve cocktail brands in the UK. They send amazing cocktails for you to enjoy at the comfort of your own home. Box Towels cocktails are vegan friendly and have a high alcohol content. Oh, that is right up my street. We love it. No canned crappy stuff. Yeah, we don't. Do we that. want the high alcohol content, oh, especially yeah. on this podcast. Ready to drink in three seconds and up to bar quality. We know that because they're served in over 100 bars across the UK. We got them delivered the other day. We had a little celebration for mum's birthday and they were lush and they came looking lovely and they tasted chef's kiss the worst thing about me joe is i think i'm a cocktail maker so trying to make them at home myself i get like everything everywhere oh you're it, terrible it never tastes good no it tastes horrible so that's Steve. why we've got the old box that's towels. why you gotta use box towels i've tried this and it's banging so box towels challenge you to blind taste test one of their espresso martinis with any others on the market and if box towels don't win they'll give you your money back oh it's a win which which you won't win yeah. You won't win. You know what I mean? And they've also given us a code for you guys to get 20% off your first order. The code is not my bag 20. That's not my bag 2G's 2-0 to get 20% off. Once again, guys, that's not my bag 20. Go get yourself a box. 20% off. And Khalid as well. Mm -hmm. I saw he went to your show in New York. And then I LA. saw... 
yeah. LA, sorry. Yeah. And then in a um, interview, he mentioned that he's got a song coming with you. Is that right? Yeah, he does. We have this really, really, really beautiful song. I was going to name it, but no, let me not. I'm getting excited. <laughs> no, it, no not, exclusives just that. yet. No. Getting, let me not. Getting excited. <laughs> feeling too at home with my mother here. <laughs> <laughs> too comfortable. That's too the problem. Comfortable. Too comfortable. But yeah, we, we um, it's so funny. The song actually came around as an accident. We we're just at the studio messing around. I just kept visiting him <laughs> and letting, just like sat no, there. No. Hi, I'm back. <laughs> like literally, hi, I'm back. And then we just started fiddling around on some beats and there was one beat that stuck. And then we just wrote the whole song. Like, That's there amazing. And then. Did you? How do you do that? Like, how do you, how do the lyrics It's like an come art form, isn't it? Just, like, we amazes, just kept mate. going back and forth. Like, we, we kept just going back. thoughts in your head yeah, and just writing it. Yeah. All. See, I find that just amazing. Yeah. Song. Just... No, it is crazy though. Like piecing together a song. Like when you think about it, it yeah. truly is an art. Like mm. it's so, it's hard. Yeah. It's hard. It is. I can imagine. It is. But no, I love that. When's that coming? Do we know? It will definitely be next year, I think. Okay. Yeah. Okay. No, so fab. I'm, I'm, I'm excited. No, yeah, I'm very no, that excited. Will be, that will be, it's going to be a moment. It's going to be very, <laughs> you know. <laughs> no, I'm buzzing because I love him. And then I know, I mean, there's, there's tons of people like Doja oh, as yeah. well. Yeah. I was obsessed when you and Doja linked up. I can't remember. Was that the first time? Because there was one, you were both, uh, there was a party. You were both in these dresses. I can't remember if it was the first time or whatever, but the, I was oh, just- Oh, the Winnie party. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, And yeah. then there was so much stuff on Twitter that were like, are they it together? Was too much. Everyone was saying that you and Doja were like a thing. We are a thing. <laughs> I, okay. We oh, just are. Okay. No, I love that. We are. <laughs> well, I guess it's confirmed now, isn't it? <laughs> We very much care to elaborate anything? No, we're a thing. <laughs> thing one and thing two. <laughs> thing one and thing two. No, I'm obsessed with that. She's she's killing it, isn't she? Yeah. She's honestly yeah. like can't take your shoes and bloody shades on. Take them off. No, uh, I just I'm I can't give, see your but eyes. I'm giving Brie. I can yeah, see I'm you. Brie. I was gonna I was gonna wear those. You're lucky. Brie was gonna wear these. I was I was like, gonna gonna wear I felt like I would just I just can't see your eyes. I don't like it. There you go. See the jet lag. Oh yeah. yeah. Right. <laughs> <laughs> right, so the Gaga remix album, the Babylon mm -hmm. track, I I mean, look, I lost my mind. I know quite a lot of people out there lost I their mind. I think you sound like her, you know, a little bit. Really? Yeah, mostly in the car. I, I was playing. I went, no, it's not. And I thought you really sounded like her. Really? Yeah. And the latest one, you sound a little bit more Irish. Oh, mum, no, mum heard. Uh, pick, very, mom, very nice. I played Pick Your Poison I, to mum. I'd love to. And oh, she said God. that it's like it's kind of like, like old 90s, school. Like, That's like, interesting. Yeah, mm. I thought it was great. That's cool. That, that, I, I thought it was an, like, an older song. And I went, who is this witness? I said, no, it's not. Because obviously I've heard all the expletives that come out of his bedroom with all the um, songs that you do. And I'm a bit like, I mum, said, she I didn't is know not. That that Brie <laughs> could sing as beautiful. <laughs> And like he said, no, she can sing as well as rap. No, it's the versatility for me because going oh. from like little Nokia to um, it's the, pretty the outrageous. New set. No, but I love it. I love it's it. Pretty outrageous. So the Gaga track, yeah, beautiful. Like, was that from Blood Pop? Did he just reach out, or how did that come about? Yeah, yeah. literally from Blood Pop. I remember I was in an apartment in Jamaica Road, and I replied to a text that I was meant to press send on, and you didn't, and I didn't. Oh, I've done and that then times. yeah, and then he was like. By the way, this is what I was trying to ask you about. That, you, you that be... was meant to happen. I if, was like, yeah. what? Mm. And I was like, can I do Babylon? And he was like, yeah, that would be great if you did Babylon. I said, well, I'm doing Babylon. <laughs> I would have it's lost my It took me ages to do it mind, though. did it? I, the excuses were rife. It was oh, actually really? bad. Like, it, just it, was like, like... It, was, it was like, I'm going to the studio to do it today. Oh, my, uh, yeah, oh, yeah. my, oh, my lace is untied. <laughs> Okay, when I get to Mexico, oh, I'll buy an SM7. Oh, oh I didn't bring the right up. cable. Oh, uh, Did you not get the ump with all that? When, I, I, when I get to America, do oh, the studio's closed. There's a leak. But was that just like putting it off because oh, you were just nervous? nervous. Yeah, yeah. I was we all get so it. nervous. Did you not want to do it then? No. <laughs> I didn't. Naughty girl. I was like, I'm not doing this. You smashed it though. You absolutely How smashed it. How did I get it together? Park. I think it's when I got to LA, I wrote it in bed. I wrote it in did bed you? in the end. In the end, yeah, I just wrote it in bed. I was like, get yourself together. I can just, just imagine you now. There. Write this now. <laughs> Stop it. Sorry. Get a cover up. I can imagine you in bed. Cover up. It's Brie, Brie, Brie. There's, yeah. there's, there's, literally, like... there's literally that. There's literally <laughs> that's, that. You see, that's probably a lack of confidence because you're with so many like bigger people out there, whatever, but you have, you're so amazing. You should really believe in yourself. Oh, mum, I do, but you know, I have my momos. <laughs> 
I have we my all, mum We all get there, mum. We all have it. We all love it. I'm having one today. You're having one today that I'm not really into. Joe, actually. mum, yeah, mum no, we're no, not getting you started again. We're not getting, because honestly, I'll be running into one, oncoming two, traffic one, two, outside. <laughs> Next up, fashion. Yeah. Fashion. Fashion. You, you know, are the fashion girl. No, you know all the big designers, don't you? <laughs> and I want you to. What is, where's the scarf from? This one's lovely. Thank you, darling. <laughs> Oh, yeah, kind of we can do a swap. You can have me MS one and I'll nick that on the way out. <laughs> <laughs> and I'll nick your jacket on the way out. And you can have my Marks and Spencer's one. What a deal. Uh, <laughs> talk, talk, us through, talk us through the look with the scarf and the shade. So today, mm. I just didn't want to wear a jacket. Fine. So I was looking for I earrings. You're in there, though, weren't you? <laughs> no, I'm kind of going from car to venue, car to venue. So it's kind of all right. Do you know what Booked I mean? Booked and busy. Booked and busy. Today, it's just like a simple. I think this is either Wolford or something else. The Wolford and then Jean-Paul Gaultier I, I Supreme can, I, Pants. I can see the little, nice. uh, the little label. Guys, I can see my camera. What does it say? I can see the label. Your mum, how do you say that? No, I can't, I'm not even going to try because I'm from Essex. No, because I've seen Bree's TikTok say? where she talks talks everyone through Gaultier? how to... Gaultier. 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 And supreme, yeah. yeah. And then big skills, I don't know where they are. By the way. We're I love about the shades. The shades are Rick Owens. Are they? Very hard They're to what, find. What Rick Owens. Do you know, you had a pair of shades and I tried to find them and I couldn't find them. Please don't do that. <laughs> That's like you trying to replicate my children. You're lucky I'm not even falling out with you over these. <laughs> I, I own this. Where are these damn I own this this frame. He wanted me to wear them. I it said was, I wouldn't um, be able to see anything out. I of think them. it was the furry ones. The Gucci ones. There, yes, they're very hard to find. The Gucci. We're gonna be blurping that out. Um, yeah. We are starting again. <laughs> Anyway, Thank you, Jesus. Bree, you're you're. Yes, yes. we are. Come on. <laughs> Let's talk about the shades. It, it, oh, I shouldn't have done that with my Botox. Did you oh, hit the table? This was going like that. Oh, no. So, oh, oh, no. Oh, Lord, it's all have mercy. Off. Mom, you dropped your gifted glasses. You, Come give, on. you give me these. I know I did. All right. Um, so from your style in it originating, when you yeah. started, I know the glasses were like a big part yes. of your brand and still are. Mm -hmm. What started that? In terms of like, did you just wake up one day and think that's that's my thing, or was it like an evolution of, of style? Did you just have a hangover like me most days <gasps> and just think I'm gonna put my sunglasses on because don't anybody see my face? I think the sunglasses thing is like my edge. Mm. But you show me your eyes. You've got the most beautiful. Look at her lashes. I mean, I mean, come yeah, on. Yeah, you have stunning eyes. Well, where do you go and get yours done? I oh, want God, those strips from Amazon. No way. Yeah. Oh, my why? God. <laughs> yeah, why? Why? <laughs> why? Why? <laughs> why? <laughs> why? <laughs> like you've got the most beautiful eyes. Like, honestly, I'm a bit obsessed with taping everything. I should have brought you a pack. Oh, honestly. But, Mum, we're twins, though. Well, I'm getting my white version. Tomorrow. I'm going to pay for mine. Yeah, you just have to go done. out and just have a pamper day together. Yeah. I was going to say We should totally this. do that. That would be so cute. You should, like, style Mum, because she's... A, I would love that. Like, you know, you because love Because she's fashion. such a bad bee. You are. And I feel like Brie could, you know, kind of... Mum, anyway, you're a bad You need to teach me all the sayings of the designer brands because I have. Well, I had to say that. Mum, you're yes. a bad bee. You are. You're a bad bee. You, you, Vuitton. 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 She said Vison. Vuitton. <laughs> and what else? What else you like wearing? I don't Versace? Know. Versace. Oh, Versace. I Versace. Kind of Versace. 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 I was Versace. watching that TikTok you did. I was like, I've said all this stuff wrong my Versace. entire Versace. life. I was Loewe. like, this, this has taught me so Say much. That again. Loewe. Oh my god. So. If there was one brand, it's like, language, isn't it? if there's one fashion brand that you could, oh my God, mom. <laughs> if there was, if there's one fashion brand that you could like design a collection for or yeah. walk for, is there one in particular that you like adore? It would be a blast from the past. Galliano Dior. Oh, nice. Dior, yeah. Yeah. We love a bit of Dior. Yeah. Mum taught me out of getting a bag at the weekend. She went for Louis instead. But no, because like, you're... Oh, y'all are rich. <laughs> no, hold on a minute. No, I, I was going you... through my LA mentality. I kind of regret it now. <laughs> I got no, home. Like, oh, it's, it's Christmas. Yeah, but I did it's say Christmas to you, soon. you need to treat yourself. And that bag above, I went, that is the one. You went, Mum, it's another two and a half thousand dollars. But I said, I don't care. Buy that one. I did, I, guys, oh, I, didn't, mom, I, didn't, I didn't. The revenue, the, said, the revenue of that you're great. I love that. No. I said, he works hard. Buy it. I love that. Work hard. All right, then buy it for me. Oh, you don't know what you got. You don't know what you got. Your birthday this week, mum. Can't um, tell Bree. Oh, what did shit. you get? It. What did you get? I got her. It's my birthday uh, Sunday. If it's shit, I'm going to message you. I got her. Oh, 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 o
I've no, got, no, no. I just thought I messed up then, but we're fine. No, we're fine. I've got, I've got a, like a, a like a zatchel from like years ago. No, don't she worry, said I've... a zatchel. <laughs> <laughs> so he's not a satchel, and he's not as wearing oh, as a satchel. Right, right. Well, 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 well. Well, well, well. Let's let's talk about why we wanted you here. Tell me. You've got something exciting coming. Well, it's this Friday when we're filming, but it will be out by the time this airs next week. You have an EP coming, which has been kept under wraps because no one knows about it. I didn't know. Oh, there's a few people that know about it. <laughs> <laughs> the but, people that are enjoying the leak. <laughs> no, you're joking. And I've got them all written down and they'll be blocked on Thursday. <laughs> no. I can't wait. I, <laughs> you know what? I, <laughs> All of y'all accounts are on my list. Uh, I would, trust I would me. hate to be you. If you're oh, watching. I hate to be me right now. Oh, no. That's terrible. Well, I yeah, haven't seen the cute. leak, so That's it's not, not cute. cute. That's awful. Yeah, it's not nice. It's kind of it, just so off-putting. It's like, why are you guys doing this? I think leaks Jealousy. are the, one of the worst things that entry does. <laughs> Jealousy. Jealousy. Jealous. Mum always jealous. says, I'm obsessed with this. Mum always says, if someone don't like you, jealous. Jealousy. Jealousy. It's true, jealous. though. They they you. Are Jealousy. 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 That's true. That's, that sounds like a well jail. song coming on. Jealousy. Jealousy. Well jail. Jealousy. I can hear that well, with these the relevant girls beat. Get next to oh, me. I could rap in the background. Jealousy. You have to teach me. Imagine Jealousy. me. That'd be hilarious. These girls trying to get next to me. Jealousy. Bitch of jealousy. 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 Backing vocals coming in. Jealousy. 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 I'm obsessed. But look, that's that shit. Ultimately, it's shit. Yeah, but it is. I thought you said it's all the shit. No. Just, <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, probably should have carried off like that. That's, shit. That was insane. <laughs> Next EP, Feet Mama Bags, is happening. Um, I don't want it to detract, though, from this moment because yeah. I, from what I've, what I mean, I've heard it. And I think it's like impeccable in terms of also different sides to you as well. Is that the one you should play? Me? What do you I think it says? What do you think it says about me as someone that listens to Brie? You're, you're um, very versatile. What, what Extremely would, versatile. What that's say. like old news though, mum. No, that's yeah, like no, but for me, for me, something blown. my age that's not actually, you well, know, been that current with all the, like loads of like, you know, sort of I played mum your discography. I mean, I listen so, yes. to Smooth and Magic, so I'm not, Oh, you know, I love thing. Smooth yeah. and I Magic. Smooth. But like for me, I was like, oh my God, you can do this, you can do that, you can do yeah. that. It's like, you are you are really, you could do everything. Yeah. It's true. But it's, you can do it. For those right, watching, it's called Whoa, What a Blur. If I said that right. Yeah. Whoa. 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 What a blur. You can't see. Um, I, Whoa! I know I can't sing. As as someone that's listened to your like entire discography yeah. multiple multiple times, yeah, I think it shows like a softer side to you mm. and a more Good mellow word. side because um a lot of your like the stuff I love are, like Little Nokia ATM. There's mm. like some aggression in it and the growls and you know what I mean the rocky side. Yeah. Whereas Pick Your Poison with Stormzy mm. is like a really soft track. Yeah. And I, I love it. Yeah, I do. Um, did you actually meet him or did you just do whatever they do in the studio? No, I met him. Did you? Shut up. <laughs> How was that? Is he lovely? Is he lovely? Super. Real I know, because I watch him on everything. Jonathan Ross Graham. And I'm like, oh my God. Yeah, he did nice. bless him. He didn't in his earpiece. Didn't work or something. And he had to do the whole thing. Got, honestly, this woman's oh, got I verbal diarrhea. Yeah, I, yeah. Like, I saw it. And he was on Jonathan Mum, let Brie tell us about Stormzy. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> You've literally just hit us <laughs> about 10 sorry. things in a set. I'm like, so what? excited, what? Oh, sorry. 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 Anyway. Anyway. Sorry. 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 I'm super mal. <laughs> super mal. <laughs> so, what did you want to know? So, stop working with Stormzy. Yes. So, um, we met at. Well, we've met multiple times, mm. but um, we've linked up properly at Coachella this year. <sighs> Love that. Yeah, and we were like, there was a couple of us in the what do you call it, the YouTube trailer. That's where okay. we'd hang out, go like kick your feet up, watch nice. like the acts on, on, um, <laughs> well, I need to take you in there one day. That was, oh, can you imagine me? I pass out. It was super cute. <laughs> and then um, we, we bumped into each other and then we had this cute encounter and he was like, see when I think of you, Brie, superstar. Brie, superstar. Oh, he ain't like, wrong. Ah, he ain't wrong. No, you, oh no, God. you. No, you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And then we just kept bumping into each other. And then in the end, we just started going to watch like, I think we watched like Megan together and oh, this you? and that, like a group of us and we were just like, yeah, 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 yeah. And then one time we went back to the trailer and his friend was like, oh, did you tell her about the song? And I was like, what song? I want to know. What? And Stormzy was like, there's this song. I think you'd sound really beautiful. Oh I was God. like, play it now, 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 play it now. Get it's your like, phone out. Oh, when, when like someone says something like that, I'm like, I want to know. I want to yeah, know. I'm yeah. like, tell me now, tell me now, tell me now. And he was like, no, I'm going to send it to you. And I said, make sure. Yeah. And he said he will. And then I think the next day or something, I texted and I was like, 
I want to hear the song. I want to hear the song. I want to hear the song. Mm. Then he sent it to me and I was like, okay. Because, you know, I'm not like a softy. You know what I mean? Like, I, I do love the head banging yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah. But I was like, no, this is actually an opportunity to show my gorgy voice off. I thought that 100%. And yeah. the, the difference, like, the this uh, starting track. Sorry, what's the word I'm looking for? In, intro, intro track. Is that intro. right? Yeah. It's, what's it called again? Archive. Archive, mommy. That, guys... I've never heard an intro to anything like this. I literally was in the car to oh. mum, shivers, goosebumps, everything. I thought it was breaking a I sweat. I thought I was going death. I know. It is so fucking good. You've said, got I said no idea. five times there. Can we turn but, it off? I love it. Can we just turn it off now? <laughs> but the versatility to go from that yeah, I know. to then pick your poison is so good. Like, yeah. Do you know what I mean? It shows yeah. so many different levels. So I mean, It's so hard to track list my stuff. I bet. Like I really have to get into a zone like... This doesn't make sense, but how can I make it make sense? But I mean, but no one's, but I don't do know that. many people that are yeah, doing no, it, it makes, like you, you do. it makes sense. in that way. I, yeah. I find it, I think music's so boring when people just stick to one thing. I don't al know anybody else actually that album. does what you do. And I'm, I've been on the planet for a lot Mom, longer than you have. Mum, don't Mom, leave me hanging. Mama. <laughs> Mama, high five. Look. Sorry, I wasn't even taking, I can't she, oh, see sorry, out these fucking glasses. I'm sorry, I should have said she's like, she's got a side problem. Sorry, I can't That's see how they mom. bloody shade uh, you. Love mate. that. That is team. Um, <clears throat> how was? How long did it take to write the EP, and what was the kind of process of of doing it? So, the finishing of it was basically one week. Wow. No way. Uh, wow, indeed. <laughs> <laughs> it was like. Dramatic. I was going to say that's bloody quick, isn't it? No, it was. Shit. It was. It was a lot that of hard work. Quick. It was a lot of hard work because I got so busy that you know some of the songs were done, kind of. But mm. then I'm one of those people like a song is never finished until I say it's finished. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's not just like day one. What happens at the studio is what and I go. Happy with it, no yeah. way. It's like we need guitar here. We need this. We need that. We need the pause here. We need this. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Can you yeah. try a different kick? I don't like that kick. Literally, <laughs> I go into such a selective process. So yeah, so you got full control. Oh, girl, girl. It's your legacy at the end of the day, isn't it? It, it is. is. I don't blame you. It is, and it's been like this since the beginning. Yeah. Like I'm. Just across everything since the mm. start. How old were you when you started doing all this? Oh God, maybe like, maybe like nineteen. Wow, I was really? a mum at nineteen. That's no way. Me. Yeah, with him? No, with my older one. Oh, it's almost thirty-four. She's a mama through wow. and through. Yeah, yeah. <gasps> You, do, you just don't give mum vibes at all. Do I not? No. It's, no I, do you know what I love about it? It's more like no. best friendly vibes. Yeah, you know what I mean? Which I love. Like, like, I want to go out with her like, yeah. immediately. Yeah, I'd last about two hours and you have to get me taxi for Lisa. <laughs> I know, but I wouldn't have you any other way. I'm, I almost spilled oh, the super mall all you? over the desk. Bree Bri introduced me to super mall. I feel like this is mad. So mum <laughs> wanted to. Um, so I talked mum through some of the lyrics of your songs. <laughs> right. And she picked like three <laughs> and she was like, I want to ask Bree like the meaning behind these lyrics. And I was like, oh my God. So so this is like a mum asking you, okay? Right, because this is what I've heard outside his bedroom, right? Lo a lot said he want to take me real high, but I know he only want my vagina. I mean, what does that mean, Brie? Explain it right now. And I already been that girl. <laughs> and <laughs> chewing on my cookie till you get locked jaw. What is that all about? Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I, I'm Message gonna. Message me later. <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm gonna tell you the truth. Okay, so the first lyric. Said he want to take me real higher, but he, oh no, he really want my vagina. vagina. So basically it just says that I just don't buy into guys selling me dreams when I know mm. what you want is vag. I oh, love that you know word. I mean? yeah. Love that yeah, word. Yeah, like vag. it's just like, but to be fair, guys really do want me for real though. Oh, I bet. Yeah, they do. Listen, I, take it well, you can. I mean, look, to my you, you you'd turn me. I mean, I've been gay since I came out of the womb, but... Stunning. You, you, you didn't make out you was, did you? Let's be honest. Oh, yeah, I've never I've pretended girlfriend. otherwise. I never pretended. Right, so what's the song <laughs> chewing on my cookie till you get locked jaw? I mean, what is all that about? <laughs> so, <laughs> so that's about. Hmm. Hmm. I kind of know what it's about, but I just. That's about. Mm. Getting personal, up close and personal. Till it hurts. Oh, right. <laughs> oh, got anyone's number? You got it? Oh, <laughs> Mum. Till Sorry, tell. Sorry, tell. Till it hurts. Oh, oh my God. But do you actually feel all these things when you're writing these songs? No, I'm just no, cheeky. I mean, like, like, no, she's got a cheeky vibe. I'm just a she's cheeky vibing. girl. And the been that girl, I feel like... I feel like been that girl... It wouldn't be surprising. 
You're very this. <laughs> they, they, wouldn't, they wouldn't have published anything that you're, I've ever written you're down. You're very this. Do you know what, Mum, though? You need a bit of been that girl today. You, I think you need to listen to that song on the way home. You and get that kind Joe, of... Joe, you've played every single song at Breeze for the last fucking... How many years? Excuse my French. How many years? And I've heard every single lyric. And I've walked out and gone, vagina. Like, and, and it, like oh my God. Dad walked anyway, past and goes... Anyway, you need, to, you need that. You need that today. You need that vibe. But, mm. but, but, but... We're going to wrap up on today's episode. Um, Brie, I wanted to finish with asking you for any lessons for anyone watching, because I've watched a ton of your interviews. and I know you're very good with advice. Potentially for like anyone, I know when you were younger, um, you kind of got brought down a lot by people. Do you know what I mean? And there's a lot of like adversity and coming up in the business. Do you have any advice for anyone like struggling with confidence, mm. attitude? Do you know what I mean about being their best self? Oh God, so many of my famous quotes just went through my head. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I should write a self-help book. You should. <laughs> um, advice for anyone that is struggling with confidence. Oh my God, there's and so many. Okay, a hard question. Okay, actually, Joe. so Sorry. I would say, I would say, see yourself as a thing in the middle of a paper. Put some legs out of it and write out everything you want to be. And just take steps and just That's be it. That's a really good answer. Yeah, see yourself well as done. like a model. Okay. Like a little business model and just put like spirals out and just write out everything you want to be. I've literally designed my life in that way. Mm. I knew what I wanted to look like, how white I wanted my teeth to be, <laughs> what kind of eyes I wanted to be and what kind of energy I wanted as a woman. And I just didn't stop until I felt those things. Yeah. Because if I went off of what life or society has tried to make me feel, I would amount to nothing. You know what I mean? Yeah. I get you. Like I yeah, wouldn't yeah. amount to nothing. So that's just amazing. No, it? I love drive. it. Drive. Literally, love go it so against much. everything they yeah. say you can't do. Yeah, and I'm, I'm, do it. Just do it. Like just goal. do it. Just do it. Words to Nike. <laughs> <laughs> well, um, I know this has probably been the most chaotic interview of your life, but I really appreciate you. I do apologise. Coming on. <laughs> And I'm so excited for the EP to come out this Friday. Fuck the leakers. And, um... Joe, what's the language? Um, and yeah, no, and thank you so much. And I will be listening, streaming, doing everything. He'll probably you know first in season you, you know, know, Yeah, you'll me. leave and I'll curl up in the ground, you know, and start something. Um, oh, but me no, on. But it means, it means the world, truly. I mean, you saw that a year ago Excuse when me, I stopped in your arms. So. For a roast. You, oh, won, and also, I invite everyone around for a roast from the pods. We'd love to get you over something. Oh, I'd about, love that. We can have about 55 people come in. Yeah. <laughs> no, just me. Just Brie. Why are we having oh, a mask? Yeah, just Brie. That's oh, right. Brie and Anique, don't worry. Yeah, yeah, Everyone, I don't know. Everyone's coming. I love that. Um, but yeah, but no. I can't do a big white fish bowl with peppers. I'll just do a roast. <laughs> We can you put peppers in it though? We're bringing the peppers, right? <laughs> We're bring, roast round us. We're bringing the peppers. Right, I'm give Scotch bonnet to you. To oh, your house. No, no, I've already had one. Could you not? Didn't end well. Oh, Lord. Right. It's, it's not easy. Let's, let's give it up for Brie. Right. 